here in New Jersey. Evidence of the drought can be seen all over the state. It's making a historic mark. This is on the Manasquan Reservoir. It's at its lowest level in 30 years when it was first filled. News 4's Adam Harding live now. Adam, really, truly an incredible sight behind you. Natalie, this one really is remarkable. If ever there was a visual representation of what this drought has done to this region, look no further than the Manasquan Reservoir behind us right now. We are not supposed to be standing where we are. This is typically underwater, but tonight, because they have not seen rain in months, conditions are only getting drier. It's a sign of our unusually dry stretch of weather. The water all but gone in parts of the Manasquan Reservoir. We've never seen it this low and, you know, a lot of the birds are looking for water because there's just no water around. The reservoir hasn't been this low since it was built. The extreme drought providing fuel for wildfires across the tri-state area. We're trying to conserve water because of the, you know, the shortage and all of that. Um, you know, we definitely need some rain. There's been a lot of fires in the area. That's the terrible yeah. part. I feel so bad for these people. There's no words for it, you know, for what, almost three months now without any steady rain. You know, so it's pretty crazy. Let's put into perspective what you're looking at. The New Jersey Water Supply Authority says the Manasquan Reservoir is almost 12 feet below full pool. You see that line right above where that black line is? Yep. That's actually the water level line. Normally, where we're standing would be underwater. I've been fishing here since I was a kid, and uh, I've never seen it anything like this. You know, visitors say it really is an unbelievable sight. The reservoir is about half empty right now. They haven't seen water levels this low since the early 90s. But tonight there is rain in the forecast. I'm really hoping for some rain. We really, really need it. Climate experts agree the rain is badly needed to help replenish what's already been lost. Never in 130 years of recorded data had a month as dry as October was or have had a fall as dry as this has been since Labor Day on. This reservoir alone can hold about an additional 2 billion gallons of water. That is how much is missing. They're at a little bit over 2 billion gallons at this point. The rain later in the week, that is certainly a start, but this region needs so much more. We're live in Howell tonight, Monmouth County. I'm Adam Harding, News 4, New York. So much more, Adam. Okay, thank you for updating us.